Monica, are what? you single? Yeah. <laughs> Do you have a Valentine's Day plans? No. <laughs> I'm not going to ask you to hang out then, because that's some corny ass shit. <laughs> for the 14th is to be doped up on Percocet. Remember it. So much is hard. I mean, everything's hard about it. It's hard. Ted's Day is terrible. It's just not, it's not worth celebrating whether you're single or in a relationship. Period. I just will not celebrate. Are you single or in a relationship? Um, I'm kind of in between the two at the moment. Single or in a relationship? I am, well, it's complicated. Are you single or in a relationship? Single, ready to mingle. How about you, single? Female listeners. Single. So I'm single. I think Valentine's Day is annoying because they already have their relationship day. You know, like their anniversary, I mean. So like, to have like a Valentine's Day is just like, they're gonna celebrate the, the anniversary anyway. And I just think people, even in a relationship, just find Valentine's Day to be annoying. It would be better than the year when uh, I went to Olive Garden by myself and got hit on by the uh, the gay waiter. No, that wasn't my ideal Valentine's Day. The fact that all my other single friends are sad about being single. It used to be sad for me. I used to call it Sad Day Single Awareness Day, you know, and celebrate with the girls and wear black and stuff. But then I realized <laughs> it's kind of just something somebody made up to sell stuff, <laughs> um, unfortunately, and make the rest of us feel bad. And I actually don't think it's hard at all. You don't? No. It's, it's just like a regular day. Well, once you stop thinking of it as a special day, it's not depressing. It'd be like getting upset about not celebrating Boxing Day. The Hallmark commercials on, on TV. Are just, you love them? No. <laughs> I'm sappy and like... Too much? Yeah, I throw up in my mouth a little bit. <laughs> I love celebrating the holiday anyway. Okay. How do you celebrate? Uh, make little valentines for my coworkers and friends. Oh, we love each other, right? All right. Did you two just meet tonight? We just met. Yes, we did. Oh. It sucks either way. If you're single, you're not single. If you're single, then you don't have somebody. If you're not single, you gotta pay <laughs> to go on a date. You spend hundred dollars. You spend five dollars. Trying to get a reservation or try to go out or do something romantic. Doing something that actually does, in some way, convey your love to your girlfriend or boyfriend that isn't just trite and overused, you know, like the red roses and the chocolates. You guys, come closer. <laughs> I'm just gonna throw this out there. You guys are really... What about, why don't you guys just go out on Valentine's Day? I like active things, like going horseback riding or going camping or doing something, you know, singing too. Singing too. Can I get a little song? Yeah. You can go slow, we can go faster, take you for a ride on my big green tractor. See, I believe is the day that most people break up. You guys just hang out tonight and then maybe Valentine's Day could be a second date? Um, we'll see what happens. I mean, but... it's early. Never you know what's really hard? When all the candy goes on sale the next day <laughs> and you have to restrain yourself from buying that like 99 cent candy at CVS. I love everything that's happening right now.